Hi, my name is Greg and I'm the pastor here at FBC Medford. Today is Friday, March 8, 2024. Welcome to today's FBC eConnect. The prophet Zechariah had an incredible vision and it is recorded in the third chapter of the book of Zechariah. He describes a scene where the priest is standing by the Lord. Satan is there too, and Satan is bringing accusations against the priest. And that seems strange until we are told that the priest is wearing filthy garments. It would seem that Satan's accusations ring true if the priest indeed is dirty. But surprisingly, the Lord rebukes the devil. Then the Lord gives this command, Take away the priest's dirty clothes and give him clean clothes. The Lord says this in Zechariah 3, 4, Behold, I have taken away your iniquity, and I will clothe you with pure vestments. No accusation can stand because the Lord, by his own hand, granted righteousness to the priest. Did you know that the Lord has done the very same thing for every person who puts their faith in Jesus? That's what the Bible tells us in 1 Corinthians 6, 9-11. In verses 9 and 10 of 1 Corinthians 6, the Bible lists all kinds of evil that would keep a person out of the kingdom of God. Things like adultery and greed and swindling, drunkenness, even idolatry, just to name a few. The devil stands at our side and he reminds us over and over again of all the times we have done these very things. How could we expect to enter the kingdom of God? 1 Corinthians 6.11 tells us, and such were some of you, but you were washed, you were sanctified, you were justified in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the Spirit of God. Like that priest in Zechariah's vision, our Lord has made us clean. No accusation of the devil can stand against the power of Christ crucified and risen from the dead. I look forward to seeing you at church on Sunday. During our time in the Word this week, we'll look at 1 Corinthians chapter 6, verses 9 through 11. We'll see you then.